I walked up to her and said, what do you think about these fires? And she said, did you fill your car with gas? Because you don't want to be in a situation where we can get out, but you can't get out because you don't have gas. She lived on it last night. Look outside, Audrey. Look how smoky it is. Yeah. Do you really want to go out there? Eric, people are donning life jackets and preparing to enter the water. What if that be life jackets? If we have to go. No. Where are we get a life jacket? This is only an hour from us. Hi, Dad. Hi, Aya. Uh, did you get my message yet? No. Uh, the wind has changed and the fire, the fire from Victoria will be in the other direction. Yeah, that's our biggest threat, I think. And that is a huge threat. So, uh, uh, you better uh, have uh, the guy from the motel. I will talk to him now and see whether it makes sense to go to one of these emergency centers. But the stuff from the south is coming I, your way. I know, good. I, okay, thank you. Okay. I mean, basically they're asking people to evacuate that are south of Eden, if you see on the map. room here anyone who hasn't got anywhere to stay or whatever okay so it's but, primarily for people who don't have anywhere to be yeah, or campers who have been you know had to move from other locations may have come from Malacuta or somewhere else where right. they've had to evacuate totally two men have sadly died fighting the flames at Cobago while a third man is still racing on the south coast and we're packing the car so that we'll be ready to leave in the morning assuming everything's okay that's my sweetie. I thought there was a fire in the house. No, it's on the TV. Is that the yeah, fire? Yeah, we're safe, Audrey. We just, that's why we're not going outside. It's because the fire is far away, but it's making it smoky. And we'll get sick. Hey, Daddy. This street? Our street. Whose street? Our street. Whose street? Our street. 